Have you ever ridden one of those? Um, emotional coasters um, are not very fun. And we've been all over the place today a little bit. So I'm back here in the meditation garden to, um, to get realigned and to find my center. So instead of being on that, I look more like this. I'm just kidding. It's not like that. Um, but we've had some good, happy moments today, too. And, you know, I think the, the common thread of seeing my father in the best mood is his love for uh, cherry popsicles. I'm sorry, red popsicles. These are what they are called. His favorite flavor is red. You know, I got it. Now we're going to interview. Okay, Pops, what is your favorite flavor? Cherry. I would love to. No, you say red. <laughs> That's our new joke. Oh, okay, my uh, favorite color is not orange, not yellow, it's red. <laughs> no, your favorite flavor is red. Red. <laughs> <laughs> well, you never know by your lips. So Dad's sitting up. That's good, huh? How many popsicles have you eaten? <laughs> Hello. Huh? We have, we have, we have a couple every day. Just give me a taste. No. no, I just give me like. Mother, one. here, have this one. No, I'm He won't eat the other half. He won't do it. Oh, that's a cute picture, both of you. Have a toast. <laughs> And on a serious note, um, his doctor came in today, Dr. Mejia, and um, you know, his bilirubin and, and some other things are, um, and his clotting factor, his, uh, I'll remember the name for that, but you know, the words out of Dr. Mejia were, you know, we are still uncertain if this liver is sustainable. And um, we're gonna watch this for a few more days. Now, they're very, very concerned about the amount of fluid that's on him. And um, swelling, he's jaundiced. He's kind of confused. And, you know, those aren't good things. But like we told you before, we are we are very proud of our father for um, making such a brave decision. It's the decision he wanted. Um, he was willing to accept the outcome. He wants to live. And so right now, what I'm working on is, is just making him understand this. I want my father to understand that, um, and he knows this that, you know, where we are right now is, I think the difference is gonna be his mindset and how he sets up his outlook every single day. And this is a conscious decision we all make. We have the power to, to set up our, our outlook. And that can score huge successes or huge failures for you if you set up the wrong outlook. So, um, he wants to live, he wants to be here. And um, I'm gonna be right by his side every step of the way. That's what I'm gonna do. So um, I'm trying to keep a good outlook. And um, it's hard today, especially when you get news like we got today. And um, so, you know, join with me in keeping a great outlook for my father. It's winter time and what? When the fireplace is on. Yeah. And we're doing this. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, do you know what I love? Shane. Shane likes to rub feet. Oh, my, yes. Oh, rub my feet. And because that's what family is all said, about. Go get it. That's awesome, Dad. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and that's, that's what's so, going to get him That through. is special. I love it. I 
Yeah, we do remember it. There's a plain of the day. Do you remember yeah. too, like, Grandpa would come to your ball games with a, a, um, 